A very unusual warning tonight from the FAA. That's right. It's asking airline passengers not to use their Galaxy 7 phones while they're flying. Tonight, KCAL Line's Rachel Kim is live at Ontario Airport with the alert and reaction from passengers. Rachel. Yeah, Susie and Jeff, it is extremely unusual for the FAA to warn passengers about a specific product. The travelers we talked to here at Ontario Airport tonight say they're surprised, but most are taking it seriously. What just happened to my Note 7? The man who posted this YouTube video claims his new Samsung Galaxy Note 7 caught on fire after charging, melting part of the phone. Brand new phone. Samsung's latest smartphone was getting good reviews with its water resistant feature and its new iris scanner, where eyes unlock the phone. But all the hype came to a halt on September 2nd when Samsung ordered a recall of the two and a half million devices after finding out 35 of the rechargeable batteries were exposed. Exploding or catching fire while the phones were charging. I heard that it's um, a danger <laughs> and it's a hazard. Just that it explodes sometimes. Now, the FAA is warning travelers not to turn on or charge the Note 7s while on planes and not to stow them in any checked baggage because of safety concerns. Samsung found that a battery cell made by one of its two suppliers caused the phone to catch fire. We asked travelers who own Samsung phones what they thought. I think that's a smart safety move. Um, just given the possibility that this could happen, you'd be putting hundreds of people at risk, and I think that's absolutely the right thing to do. Yeah, I worked in electronics for a lot of years, so I kind of know that sometimes they outsource these things, and it's really not their fault that the batteries are having these issues. So I don't think it's that much of an issue. While most told us they'll stick with Samsung, Tony Brown is going to try something new. Well, I kind of like Samsung more than the iPhones, but um, I'm going to try the new iPhone 7. Now, in one of those 35 cases, a family in Florida said that when they left their Note 7 charging in their car, it caught fire and destroyed the car. But fortunately, in all of these cases, no injuries reported so far. Susie.